Play ball safely. <laughs> Ta-da! Whoa, cool new ball. How'd you get it? I begged for it, and my parents finally had to give in. Wow, let me see it. Nice and bouncy. Feels just right. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Oh. Hey, you're getting it dirty. Uh, well, what do you want to do? Look at it or play with it? Play, I guess. Uh, Catch it if hey, you can. I'm faster than you are. <laughs> oh, come on, Doug. Let's go to the park. Okay. Peek out. <laughs> hey, where's the ball? Uh, Kevin, look. Oh, sorry, boys. My ball! Oh, no. Oh, I tried to stop in time, but you shouldn't play with a ball near the road. Kevin! Oh. 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 That's bad. Was oh. Kevin upset? Yeah. Well, I'm sorry his ball burst, but it's lucky there wasn't an accident. You're right, but the boys are so disappointed. I've got to do something, Polly. Hmm, I think I have an idea. Great. What is it? There. Good as new. This looks awful. Sorry. Next time you should be more careful. Learn from your mistake. Don't play with it near the road. Don't, Don't worry, worry, we, we won't. won't. <sighs> Here, give me! Uh. Uh. No! Uh. 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 Don't you remember what my mom just said? Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's so boring just holding the ball. Give it to me. I'll carry it. No, it's mine. I'll do it. Let me. I will. Get it. Come on. Kevin and Doug must have gone home. Oh, Kevin, stay there! Kevin, are you okay? Yeah. Thanks a lot, Polly. Kevin, Doug, this is your second near accident so far today. I know, but I really tried to hold on to the ball this time, Polly. Kevin, you can always get another ball, but you can't get another life. Yeah. Can you remember a few simple rules for when you play ball? Sure. Don't play ball where there are cars nearby. Play in the park. <laughs> when you're focused on the ball, you might not realize when a car's coming, and that's dangerous. If the ball goes out into the road, never run out after it. Just wait until the ball comes to a stop, cross safely, and then pick it up. Or ask an adult to get the ball for you. Okay, Polly. And now, ta-da! What's that, Polly? It's a ball bag. You carry your soccer ball in this, and you don't have to worry about it rolling away. When you carry a ball in your arms, there's always a chance it can get you into danger. When you don't have a ball bag, use a plastic bag instead. Here, Kevin, this is for you. Oh, thanks. Hey, Doug, whoa, a new ball, too. <laughs> wow. Thank you, Polly. Well, actually, the ball's from Dump. The truck? He said to say that he was sorry about running over your ball. Wow, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> Here it goes. You better catch it. Come on, Doug, pick it. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 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 
Hold my hand for safety. But we're gonna be late for the show. Wait, Lucy! <laughs> oh, come on, can we slow down? Wow. There's a lot of people coming to see the Snow White play right now. Hallie, let's be sure to keep a lookout. There's a lot of people in one place, so I don't want anyone to get lost. Sounds good to me. Hello, fair princess. I brought you this fresh apple. Huh? Would you please take a bite? Oh, my. How very kind. Oh, no! Don't eat the apple! Daddy, don't let her eat it! <laughs> uh, no, Lucy. It's a play. Ah, my love. Open your eyes. <sighs> look, look! They're happily ever after! <laughs> huh? Is it over yet? <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> You should bring your mom next time, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Dad, I gotta go. Really, really bad. Right now? Mm. Uh, over there. Let's all go. <laughs> I mean, if you are. It's a princess in real life, Snow White. Oh no! Uh, Lucy, don't tell me you have to go too. Huh? Lucy? Lucy! Tomorrow's just the matinee. Thank goodness. Princess Snow White! <laughs> Snow White? Oh. Snow White? Oh. But where could the princess have gone? And where did my dad go? Did I go too far? Oh! That's where the play is! I'll go that way! I'm so smart. Lucy! 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 Is something wrong? Afraid so. My daughter Lucy's gone. What? Lucy's lost? It's my fault this is happening. Just stay calm. We'll be able to find her. We should check places nearby. Mm -hmm. Got it. I'm Snow White. Here I go. Socks so clean as white as snow. <laughs> oh, I'm hungry. Oh, all right. That was good. Huh? Hi, little cat. Do you want a treat? Oh, Kitty, come back! Lucy! Where are you? Lucy! Hmm. Huh? I found her! Lucy! Uh, 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 Lucy's not my name. <laughs> uh, yeah, my bad. I wonder where Lucy could have gone. Here, kitty, kitty! Huh? Where did he go? Oh no, I can't see the balloons from the play anymore. I'm not where I should be. Huh? Huh? <laughs> hey, kid, look out! Oh, I'm really sorry, sir. <laughs> you should really be careful, miss. You could get hurt. Sorry about your box. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy! Where are you? Daddy! Lucy! 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 It's Dad! I'm over here! <laughs> oh, watch out! Lucy! Hang on! Daddy! Lucy! <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> that was a close one, Lucy. Your dad was worried about you. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Dad. We're just glad that you're safe. If you ever do get lost again, here are some things that might help. In large crowds of people, it's easy to accidentally get separated from your parents. Always hold on to your parents' hand. If you do get lost, don't run away quickly. It's better to stop in one place and wait for them to find you. If you see a police station or a fire station, you can ask them to help you. Tell them your name, your parents' names and information, and their phone numbers as well. Got that, Lucy? I know what to do now. 
It's Snow White! <gasps> Snow White's oh, here? So cool. Hey, Dad, let's go see Snow White together. Yeah, that sounds great. <laughs> Hi, Snow White! <laughs> 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 Fire that can't be quenched. Charles, looks like I'm all done. How about you? Yeah, I'm just about done. <laughs> it's all clean. <laughs> What's with you two? This is your fault. Yeah, my bad. Anyway, I'm all done cleaning. Come in. Yahoo! <laughs> Hang on. One last thing. Huh. Finished. Ta-da! All seven episodes Whoa. of the newest Super Dragon series. Hmm. That's cool, but... Ha-ha! It's only the best latest Ninfrendo. Ow! Beware my Super Dragon fist! Huh? Wow. wow! What's that, Charles? It's called an oil lamp. That looks super old and stuff. Yeah. My mm. grandpa used it a long time ago. What's this thing? A telescope. Wow! Oh. Hmm. Whoa. Wait! What's this? My personal favorite, a ham radio. Ham? It's great. People use them to communicate all over. You can talk to other people with ham radios all around the world. And one day, I really hope to hear aliens. Aliens? Let's, Let's try it now! Hello, aliens. Do you hear me? Beep, boop, beep. Um, aliens? This is for the rescue squad. Oh, man. It's just the rescue squad. Hey, is that Charles I hear? Sure is. We made a secret clubhouse at Peter's place. Oh. <laughs> wow! Clubhouse? Yeah, you guys should come over and say hi. Huh, sounds good. We can't turn down an invitation like that. Of, of course. course. <laughs> Aliens, do you copy? Hello? Do you copy? Uh, oh, man, it's not working. Uh, huh? Aliens? That was just me needing food. I'm hungry, too. Yeah? Maybe we should eat my super food stash. Food, food stash? Hmm. Huh? Awesome! Huh? Where are all the snacks? Peter, quit messing around. What? Who, me? Huh? Whoa! Is it aliens? But I turned the radio off, you guys. Get away! Get off! Get off! No, it's on my coat! Water! I'll put it out with water! Hey, kids! Dinner's ready! Peter? <gasps> ah! Fire! Huh? Is that smoke coming from Peter's house? Oh! Huh. I'm here! What happened? Roy! Oh. I tried to put water on the gas lamp, but the fire just got bigger! Is that so? I see! Don't worry! <laughs> <laughs> It's great that you're all safe. Listen, if a fire starts from oil, you should never pour water on it. Why? Fire from oil can't be put out with water. Putting water on burning oil can spread the oil and make it even more dangerous. Instead, for grease fires, use a fire extinguisher or sand to put them out safely. These type of fires usually start when we're cooking or using indoor heaters, so always keep an eye out. I understand. Mm -hmm. I'll be careful, too. Thank you, Roy. Thanks, Thanks Roy. Roy. We'll, we'll be, be careful. careful.
Aw, we put so much work into that clubhouse. Hmm. I lost my poor Ninfrendo. Uh. My ham radio, too. Huh? Whoa! Could it? No <gasps> way! <gasps> oh. Wow, that's definitely aliens! We've totally made contact! All, All right! right. <laughs> <laughs>
It's even more dangerous for children to sit in someone's lap in the front seat. Without the protection from a seat belt, serious accidents can happen. And kids never fight or play rough in a moving car, okay? Okay. Thanks, Thanks Holly. Holly. We, we won't forget. forget. We're finally here! Yahoo! Kevin, Kevin are, are you okay? okay? What's wrong? Is it safe to get out of the car now? Oh, yeah! You go ahead. Huh? <laughs> Wild about safety. All right, guys, listen up. We're seeing more wild animals again. Recently, a wild boar broke into Tracky's field and broke his fence. Yesterday, Mr. Wheeler saw a bear on his climbing trail. And then there was a snake at the campsite. Ugh, snakes, oh no! We need to make sure that people stay safe in their encounters with animals. That's right. Maybe we should set up signs near the forest so people can stay alert. Good, sounds like a plan. You, you got, got it. it. You guys ready to take some pictures now? I sure am. Ta-da! It's the newest model. Cool, right? I love it. Peter, for good photos, you need more than a good camera. You need skills, too. Like this, and this, and this! Right. Uh, anyway, let's go. I want to get lots of animal uh, photos before it gets dark. Yeah! Huh? Hang on! Wait up! Hmm. And this is how I'm going to get the best squirrel photo. Huh? A squirrel! Stop running, squirrely! Look! Whoa, what a cute baby bird! You can call me Peter, the master photographer. Oh? <laughs> Wanna take a selfie together? Okay. Say cheese. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, okay. Okay, I'll leave him alone. Ah. Wow. What a nice butterfly. Taking pictures sure is fun, right? Not, Not really. Huh? What on earth happened to you guys? Nature, Nature photography, photography is harder, harder than, than we thought. thought. Huh? Whoa! <laughs> it's a baby deer! Awesome! There's no way this can go wrong. Here I go! Let's go, let's go! Oh, uh, but wait! You know we shouldn't go too deep in the forest! <laughs> cool. Wow. Piece of cake. <laughs> Peter! Johnny! Be quiet. We don't want to scare the deer away. Almost got it. Ah! Ah! Snake! It's a snake! <laughs> Peter! Hey, are you hurt? Oh, I think I sprained my ankle. More snakes! More snakes! This forest is really pretty today. Help! Huh? Help! What's this? Someone, Someone please, please help, help us! Huh? Huh? Amber! Amber! <sighs> <sighs> hey, what's wrong? Amber, Peter fell in a snake pit and can't get out. That's not good. <sighs> Leave the snake alone. It will only attack you if you bother it first. For for real? Yep. Now hold on tight. Uh. It's time to get you out of the snake's house. Uh. Well, you're uh. safe. Just relax, okay? Uh. Thanks a lot, Amber. Thank, Thank you. you. 
That was dangerous. You shouldn't disturb animals. I didn't know I was gonna fall in the snake's house. We must remember the forest can be a dangerous place. We always have to stay on the designated walking paths. Going off the trail means you might run into some wild animals. If you do encounter a creature, don't throw anything at them, scream, or run away. That might scare them or make them angry, which is worse. The best thing to do is back away slowly. Assess the situation and if you need to, hide behind a tree or some rocks. Got that? Think you can remember? Hmm, we'll, we'll remember. remember. Ah! A snake! Oh, man. It's just a little squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> when lightning strikes. That's a purple emperor, and that's a tiger swallowtail. Wow, those, those are, are really cool. cool. Hmm, it's not that cool. I think butterflies are boring. I know. Beetles are way cooler than butterflies. Oh, huh? butterflies? Wow! Charles, mm -hmm. are these your pictures? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've always said that butterflies are so huh? awesome. What? Didn't I? You said that butterflies were... <laughs> Whoa! That blue one is great! What a pretty color! And it looks even better in the wild. Really? Uh, Cindy, I could catch one. Huh? <laughs> you could? <laughs> You're terrified of any bug. You catch a butterfly? Yeah, so? I bet there's no way you could catch one. What? I challenge you to catch a blue butterfly before me. Deal. There's no way I'll lose. Uh, you guys are so weird. <gasps> you guys, problem. We're getting a huge thunder and lightning storm later today. Are you oh. sure, Jen? It looks sunny outside huh. now. Helly, weather is unpredictable sometimes. We should start getting ready now so the town doesn't get damaged. Yeah, and we should warn people, too. Great! I'll go check the outskirts of town. Yeah, and I'll alert people downtown. Sounds good. Let's get to it. You, you got, got it. it. <laughs> Catching a butterfly is a piece of cake. Whatever. I'll definitely get one before you do. Huh? Butterfly! Nice. Hey guys, a yellow sulfur. Wow. I'm sure the blue variety is around here. Yeah. Oh, what are they up to? Maybe it's over here. Huh? Ah! 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 <laughs> Just a little closer. Uh! Uh! Huh? Ah! Quite the same. Charles, run! Ah! 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 <sighs> My everything hurts, and I'm starving. Hey, you know, we can always try again. Huh? It started raining. Let's go hide under that tree. Your lightning rod is good to go. Thanks, Roy. But when the lightning starts up, you should still take shelter indoors in a safe area. And don't stand under a tree. Why? Is it dangerous? Yes. Trees have a high risk of getting struck, so it's best to keep away. Now it's going to make me real nervous. Oh, wait. Roy, I saw some kids go into the woods a while ago. Oh, no. If this weather gets worse, mm -hmm. will they be OK? <gasps> mm -hmm. oh. They're not safe. Ah! Uh, it wasn't supposed to rain. Uh. Huh? You guys, it's the blue butterfly. Wow, that's ah. it. I'll get it first. Huh? Guys, stop! Huh? Ah! Look out! Ah! Uh, uh, are you kids okay? Mm -hmm. uh. Come on, let's get you home, now! <laughs> that was a close one. You could have been hurt. Thanks, Roy. You're, You're so, so awesome. awesome. Listen, 
You have to remember a couple things when it comes to storms. Never play outside if you hear thunder or see lightning. And if you're outside, find shelter in a building or inside a car. Buildings and cars provide much needed protection from lightning's dangerous electricity. Lightning strikes in higher places too. So be sure to stay away from mountains or other high places during storms. If you stand near a tree, you can get hurt because trees are more likely to be struck by lightning. If there are no buildings or cars nearby, go to an open area and lay flat and small on the ground. Finally, don't hold any metal objects like umbrellas or butterfly nets. These conduct electricity and you could get hit. We were under a tree though. Mm. And not just that, we were holding these nets too. That, that was, was really, really dangerous. dangerous. Good, lesson learned. Mm. Huh? But mm. why are you sad? We tried to catch the blue butterfly. Huh? Wow, blue butterflies, guys, they're everywhere. Really? Yeah! <laughs> Rainy Day Dangers Ha! Uh, 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 ouch! Uh, Jenny! That hurt! Uh, I'm sorry. Gotcha! <laughs> hey! No fair! <laughs> Never let your guard down! <sighs> Boys are weird. <gasps> oh, great! I forgot my umbrella. <laughs> Don't worry, Jenny. I'll share mine with you. Huh? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Nice try. And even though I don't really want to, I guess I can share my umbrella with a classmate. Jenny! Oh. Hi, Mom! Thanks, guys. See you tomorrow! Oh. See you, Jenny! Oh. Oh. I hate it when I act polite for no yeah. reason. Oh. But now you can give your umbrella to me! <laughs> what? Why should I? You broke mine! Did not! Did too! You okay, Posty? Sure. Thanks, Polly. Hey, Polly. Roy. Hello, Spooky. Posty, you all right? Heard your day's not going too well. Yeah, I had a slip. Roads can get slippery, especially on rainy days like this one. So drive carefully. Don't worry. I'll take good care of our friend Posty. Thanks. Bye, guys. Be safe, Spooky. Well, Roy, I'm heading over to the school. Yeah, I guess classes are over by now. Right. And I want to make sure the students all get home safely. You be careful too, Polly. Will do. Quit hugging it, I'm all wet! I'm getting wetter than you, Kevin. Wrong! Ah! Kevin, uh, what do we do now? Uh, I don't know! Uh, 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 this rain just won't go away! I'm so, so am I. Uh, uh, let's cross. Okay. Oh, oh, gotta hurry. Oh, oh, no. I can't see. Hey, look out. Oh, oh, I'm rolling too fast. Oh, this won't be pretty. I'm sorry, Polly. I warned you about driving on wet roads. It's dangerous. You were right. I'll keep that in mind. Kevin and Doug, you should have been more careful too, especially since it was raining. Us too? When it rains, it takes more time and distance for a car to stop because the roads are more slippery than usual. Don't walk too close to the curb. It's safer to keep your distance from cars when it rains. It's also a good idea to stay back a few steps from crosswalks. If you get too close, a car could hit your umbrella. 
always hold an umbrella higher than your eye level so you don't block your view. An umbrella you can see through is even better. Use a shoulder bag when it's raining to carry papers, books and other things so they don't get wet. When it's dark and rainy, it's safer to wear brightly colored clothes and use a bright umbrella. Dark clothes and dark umbrellas make you hard to see and make accidents easy to happen. It's the same on snowy days, but don't wear white clothes when it snows. They make you blend in too much. Wow! We, we blocked, blocked our view with the umbrella and walked, walked right, right into the crosswalk without looking. We even had a dark umbrella. Ugh, we, we got, got it all wrong. wrong! That's true, but now you know how to get things right as rain. Yeah! <sighs> Jenny! You've got nothing to worry about today. You can't share that tiny umbrella with him. Here, I'll share mine. Thanks, guys. But I'm covered. <laughs> OK. Well, see you tomorrow. <sighs> Jenny, wait, wait for me. me. Try to keep up. <laughs> 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 Spooky, great job! <laughs> Thanks, it means a lot, Stacy. Oh, wait, one more thing. Hang on. I have a little surprise for you. What's the surprise? Every time you help one of your friends in need, I'll give you a sticker. After five, I'll get you those rainbow tires you really want. Whoa, rainbow tires? Woohoo! That's awesome! <laughs> well, I guess there's no time to waste. See you later! See you around! Good morning, Broomstown. Today's gonna be another hot, scorching day. So make sure to limit your time outside and stay safe and healthy. <laughs> I'll get all the stickers real soon. Then new tires for me. Somebody help! I'm stuck! Whoa, it's Benny. Hang on, buddy, I got this. All better. <laughs> Thanks a bunch, Spooky. Don't worry about it. Just try to be more careful. <laughs> Spooky seems like he's in a really good mood today. Aw, oh, Peter, why didn't you kick it to me? It's too hot to aim right. Johnny, go bring back the ball. No, nah, it's your fault it's so far. You get it. Uh, I don't wanna. Hiya, Posty. Sorry I'm a bit late. What took you so long? You have no idea how busy I am today. Huh? We'll make up for lost time. Uh, ah, spooky! You're going too fast! Faster? I can go faster. You got it. Hi, Musty. Hope you weren't here long. <sighs> but I'm ready to tow you back now. Ooh, you certainly work hard, even in this weather. <laughs> Yep, no time like the present. Uh, you got the wrong place! That's my nose! Spooky, wait! Are you sure you'll be all right? Yep, I'm great. Don't push yourself, Spooky. Maybe we should call Roy to help us out. No way. Mm. I can do it myself. Mm. <laughs> oh. Wow, you really got this. I'm impressed, Spooky. Hey, thanks. I do what I can. <laughs> and done. Wow, there's only one sticker left. Uh, Spooky, uh, are you sure you're okay? I think you should take a break. No, no, I feel great. Yep, time to go. Wait! Uh, he's working too hard. Uh, one more to go. Just one more sticker till I get those tires. Well, I don't feel so good. Today, uh. everything feels so heavy. I just want to go home and relax. Uh, this is not good. Ah! Kids in the room! Huh? Ah! Ah, look out! <gasps> Spooky's on the coast road, oh. hanging off the cliff. Rescue team, you know what to do. Okay. Spooky! Help me! 
I don't want to fall. No need to worry. We're here to help. Helly, hold Spooky up from below. Roy and I will stay up here and pull him back up. Sounds, Sounds good. good. Got you! We're on. Ready to pull. Okay, let's bring him in. <laughs> Spooky! <laughs> and there you go. Thanks a lot, Amber. Spooky, that could have been really bad. You should have given yourself a day of rest. Whenever there's a heat advisory, it's best to follow warnings and not play outside. When it's hot, we sweat and lose water. So we need to drink more water and avoid dehydration. If you have a headache, dizziness, or feel sick to your stomach, get to a cool place as soon as possible to lower your body temperature. And if you still don't feel better after a while, call an ambulance. You might have heat stroke, which could be very dangerous. I see. I won't work too hard in hot weather anymore. <laughs> And, and we'll, we'll be, be careful, careful too. too. Your health is the most important thing. I know, but I just really wanted to collect that last sticker. <laughs> you already did. Here you go, rainbow tires. Oh, did I really do enough for them? Benny called me and said you helped him oh, out as well. That's right, I did. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> rainbow tires. <laughs> oh, <so sweet. laughs> Can I get three more? <laughs> Our family fire drill. Have a nice day. Oh, hi, Roy. <laughs> Afternoon. What's that? Fire evacuation drill? Yep. Families can all do this program, practice fire drills, and make a plan so they know just what to do. If they pass, they get a safety badge, too. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Would you like one? Uh -huh. Goodness, what's going on? Oh, oh no! <sighs> what a mess. What would they do if a real fire broke out? <laughs> <laughs> Straighten this mess out. Honey, you came home. Here, look at this. Huh? Family fire evacuation? Wow, what's that? <sighs> Seems like a lot of fun. Shall we do it? Yeah, yeah! I want to go too! Oh? So everyone agrees? How great! Drill start now. Huh? huh? In one week, we'll be participating in this drill program. Let's do our best to try and stay safe in the event of a fire. Got it? Yes. yes. So, everyone look at this map here. Who can tell me how many exits our house has? I, I can, can! I can! can. <laughs> okay, what's next? Don't know. I think... Ah! Back door, Lucy. Okay. <laughs> Daddy! Don't worry. Dad will always be there to save you. <laughs> oh. <sighs> okay, everyone. The test will begin shortly. When the fire alarm starts, you have three minutes to get out of the house. Ready, set... There's smoke! Get down! Don't be nervous, you two. Just do what we practiced. Got it? Yeah! Leave it to me! Go to the first exit. Front door's on fire. No uh, good. Option two, the window. The window. Uh, honey, the window's blocked too. It's all going to be fine. We'll find a way out. 30 seconds remaining. No! <laughs> 
Ridiculous. I'll never leave you behind. Three, two, one! Congratulations! You all made it! <laughs> wow! Awesome job, Dad! Yeah! Phew. There you go! Wow! <laughs> you were able to react quickly with every situation that arose. Often, when there's a real fire, people will panic and forget their safety rules. It only takes five minutes for a fire to spread to dangerous levels, so always remember your evacuation plan. Make a map for your family that clearly marks all emergency exits. Everyone should pick a safe place to meet after evacuating. Twice a year, you should have an actual fire drill with your family. It's good to try it both during the daytime and at night. That way, if a real fire broke out, you know you'd be able to get everyone out of the house safely. Got it, Roy! We, we sure, sure will! will. <laughs> <laughs> fire! 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 Where? Fire, where? fire drill time again! Roy said so we need to do a drill at night, too! Let's go! No, you didn't mean right away! 